Hey guys. Welcome to Couple. Please like and subscribe if you like the video. Donald Trump Jr. called veteran journalist Carl Bernstein, famous for his reporting on the Watergate scandal, a leftist hack on Sunday. The president's eldest son tweeted the jab at Bernstein and CNN's chief national security correspondent Jim Sciato for their report in July that said Trump's longtime personal lawyer Michael Cohen was ready to tell special counsel Robert Mueller that President Trump signed off on Trump Jr. and campaign officials meeting with Russians in hopes of obtaining dirt on Hillary Clinton. That report was cast in doubt last week when Cohen's attorney, Lanny Davis, said on CNN that the reporting of this story got mixed up and definitively said no, he does not when asked if his client had knowledge beforehand or immediately after the Trump meeting took place. Michaels Cohen's attorney clarified the record, saying his client does not know if President Trump knew about the Trump Tower meeting, out of which came nothing. The answer is that I did not know about the meeting. Just another phony story by the fake news media, the president tweeted Saturday. His son followed with a shot at Bernstein and CNN on Sunday. Comical to watch at CNN covering for leftist hack at Carl Bernstein. He and Obama staffer at Jim Cieto obviously got story wrong. CNN stands by it anyway, defending literal fake news. Three reporters were fired for fall CNN hit on former White House communications director Anthony Scaramucci and this is far worse. Trump Jr. tweeted Sunday, referring also to CNN researcher and producer Marshall Cohen comparing the current situation to the exit of three CNN journalists last summer following a retracted report on a Russian investment fund with ties to Trump officials. Trump Jr.'s tweet came in response to a Washington Post report in which a CNN spokeswoman said, We stand by our story, and are confident in our reporting of it. That same report acknowledged that Post follow-up to CNN's story, which said Cohen told associates he witnessed a discussion between Trump Jr. and his father about the forthcoming Trump Tower meeting, had Davis as an unnamed source, who is now coming out to admit he didn't have that information confirmed. I should have been more clear including with you that I could not independently confirm what happened, Davis told the Post in admitting on the record he was the source. He added, I regret my error, 